my advice, okay? If you just really believe in yourself and know you're doing your best and you're proud of the way you're living, then one day you might wind up on a pink backdrop just like playing with a shit ton of puppies. What's better motivation than that? Hi, I'm Amy Schumer and I'm answering fan questions while playing with puppies. Okay, guys, are you ready? Have you ever had an embarrassing workout story, an incident happen to you? Like Renee and I feel pretty. Um, well this dog just like kind of peed on me. An embarrassing workout experience. Yeah, I've had a lot. Oh, one time when I was working out and going for a walk in Austin, I, uh, I shit myself. You guys know what that's like. Oh, he doesn't even want it, he just wants love. Hi. Oh, what about this one? Hi. Okay, sorry, questions, okay. Renee kind of has a traumatic online group date experience. Have you had a bad online dating experience? I, I was online dating for like truly 24 hours. And uh, it was traumatic enough that I wanted to get out of there. But then I have, I've also had a, you know, I also met a, a guy I had like a nice couple years relationship with from online. So I've got no online hate. But you can start to feel really bad about yourself. You know, it's like you kind of get judged, like, this is how much you're worth. Um, yeah, and it, it makes you feel bad about yourself. It's such a meat market. But I don't know, a lot of people fall in love on there. Like, we just fell in love, but I think we got these dogs online. <laughs> I like that there's wet footprints and, like, we know what it's from. I'm stranded on a desert island. Which of these people that I've worked with before do I want with me? Goldie Hawn, LeBron James, Jennifer Lawrence, or John Cena? Goldie Hawn. Hands down. Goldie is, you want to be stuck anywhere with her. Um, because Jennifer would eat me. You know, she'd be like, this is fun, we'll have fun. And then she'd start looking at me like I was a chicken. Really fast. Um, but Goldie would, you know, we'd at least party for a little while first. Okay. What makes you feel pretty? Puppies. Um, I feel pretty, uh, oh, that's actually, thank you. <laughs> thank you, sir. Yeah, be around your friends. That, I know it sounds corny, but seriously, when you're just like with your friends and you're laughing and you just feel really like yourself and authentic, and yeah. But also when someone has sex with you, you feel pretty. You're like, okay. I must have looked well enough that uh, you wanted to have sex with me, so that's a compliment. How will married life change your stand-up material? <laughs> Sir? Um, I don't know. I just started doing it. I mean, it's... Nobody's ever gonna text me you up again. Uh, so, I'll just have to start just... You know, talking about... Uh, Ma'am? Ma'am? <laughs> Ma'am, ma'am, Givenchy, ma'am. Oh, I can't stay mad at you. Uh, I don't know. I just need to get a lot of dogs. You're a little fighter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jennifer Lawrence recently said you gave her some tough love after a breakup. Has she ever given you similar advice? Well, I didn't give her advice. I just sent her flowers saying that I was sorry that she was gonna die alone. And I stand by that, I, I love Jennifer. She's one of my best friends and... And you know, she's beautiful on camera and she's, um, she's an incredible actress, but in a person, when, you're, when Jennifer's up close, she, um, it all melts away and she's very hideous. <laughs> uh, Jen is, um, yeah, I knew I could mess with Jen about her breakup. She'll she'll bounce back quick. What, what if that was an important question? What if this happened with the the Constitution? What's the craziest rumor you've ever heard about yourself? Um, I read a rumor once that I had. I don't even want to say this, but it was that I'd gone to jail for punching someone in the face at the Oscars, and I've never gone to the Oscars. Um, but yeah, it was written as fact. 
Congrats on your marriage. How and when did you know your husband was the one? When he introduced himself as a chef. You worked with Michelle Williams and Busy and I feel pretty. Were you a big Dawson's Creek fan growing up? Yes, of course. I have a beating heart. So of course I like Dawson's Creek. What are you doing? Because you just got very still all of a sudden and I'm definitely concerned about that. What about you? Look at this little face. Are you so cute? Oh. What celebrity makes you laugh the most? Uh, what celebrity makes me laugh the most? Ow! <laughs> Damn it. Uh, the, the funniest, you know, your teeth are no joke. Like, we gotta be real. David Tell makes me laugh the most, the comedian. And he's in the movie. <laughs> Truly biting glass. Truly. You, you're a little vampire. You're like Robert Pattinson. Look at this. I'm gonna name you Robert Pattinson, and you're Kristen Stewart, and you're Anna Kendrick, and you're Taylor something. Momsen. All these puppies are available for adoption at North Shore Animal League America. Except for this one. You're coming home with me. Are you gonna see the movie?